Greetings, and welcome to DB Forge Edge Tutorials. Perhaps you already know that DB Forge Edge is a multi-database solution that comprises four studios, advanced IDEs for database development, management, and administration. All of them are classic Windows applications, but in this video, you will learn how to install and run them on macOS without compromising your experience. For that purpose, you can use Crossover, a commercial compatibility solution that allows running Windows apps on macOS and Linux, and offers a free trial to get acquainted with its capabilities. Before we proceed, please take a moment to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. There are lots of helpful database tutorials with best practices awaiting you. And now let's see how Crossover works. It is an application that you install on your Mac. In this application, you can create customizable Windows environments and store them in separate containers called bottles. When you start installing new Windows software, like DB Forge Edge, Crossover creates a new bottle automatically. You can have as many bottles as you need. Moreover, you can store multiple Windows applications in a single bottle if these applications require the same configurations. You could say that Crossover works similarly to virtualization solutions, such as Parallels Desktop. In a way, yes, but there's a difference. If you choose Parallels Desktop, you need to purchase and install it first. And while you are setting it up, you need to purchase a new Windows license, then install and configure it in your Parallels Desktop. And only then can you install and run Windows applications on it. When it comes to Crossover, everything is much simpler. No Windows license is needed. First, you install Crossover Mac on your machine. Then you run it and install the apps of your choice along with the required prerequisites. Crossover will notify you if something is missing. And that's it. Now that you know how Crossover works, let's proceed to install it. First, go to the official Codeweaver's website and download its archive. Then double-click the downloaded archive to extract the application. Click Open to launch it and then agree to move it to your Applications folder. Once it's done, you can proceed with installing the main prerequisite component required for DB Forge Edge to run properly. .NET Framework 4.7.2 To do that, open Crossover. On the Install a Windows Application page, start typing Microsoft Net Framework 4.7.2 in the search box. Next, click it in the search results. Then, on its dedicated page, click Install you will be prompted to select a bottle for the Net Framework package to be installed into. Click Select a bottle to either create a new bottle or select an existing one. If you create a new bottle, specify the bottle name and make sure you select the Windows 1064-bit bottle type. Then click Done. The installation of the Net Framework package begins. Please note that it may take some time. Now the installer will guide you through all the steps. You will only need to agree to license terms a few times. After the successful installation of the last required component, Net Framework 4.7.2, click Finish. Now Crossover is ready to install DB Forge Edge into the bottle. Before you begin, download the DB Forge Edge installer file from our official website and place it in a folder of your choice. Then in Crossover, go to the newly created bottle and click either Install in the lower left corner of the screen or install application into bottle under bottle actions. On the install a Windows application page, click install an unlisted application. On the unlisted application page, click install. Now you need to specify the location of the previously downloaded installer file. In our case, it is the default downloads folder. Find and select the required file and click choose installer. The installation begins and Crossover proceeds to install DB Forge Edge. In the installer window that opens, click install. On the Select Destination page, select the folder for DB Forge Edge to be installed into and click Next. On the Select Products page, specify the studios that you want to install and click Next. The installation will commence. After the installation is completed, click Finish. In a few moments, the installed studios will appear in the bottle. Now you can launch them and freely explore their capabilities on your machine. And last but not least, before you launch the studios, we suggest you turn on the high resolution mode toggle in the bottle configuration under advanced settings. Then reboot the bottle by clicking reboot bottle and enable high resolution mode. This will make your work with the studios more convenient. And now let's launch all four studios to see how well they work through crossover. And everything is great. 
Now we're all set to establish our connections and manage our databases. There's one more thing that we find worth mentioning. If you are an avid user of Terminal, you can use it to run DB Forge Studios and perform specific operations with them. As an example, let's compare the schemas of two databases. To do that, we run the following command, where this is the command that initiates crossover. This is the parameter that specifies the name of the bottle that contains the studio. These are the options that configure the launch of the application. And finally, this is the command that performs schema comparison with the specified options. Now we're going to run a schema comparison in each of the four studios. And so it begins and finishes successfully. That's it. Note that you can easily run batch files and automate the launch of DB Forge Studios from the command line using the standard scheduler. Ready to try it all yourself? Then do not hesitate to get a free 30-day trial of DB Forge Edge. Just download it from our official website and check it in action. That's it for today. Like if you've enjoyed the video, share your thoughts in the comments section below, and subscribe to our channel to get the latest database tutorials. Thank you for watching.